you know you like that. You know you like that. You know you like that. Honestly, it's better like that. I know we've been falling on track. Bring it right back. I just let the time go past. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. It's your girl Amanda, and you are watching the Sangines on YouTube. I've got Christopher with me. We are going to meet Dada for some lunch, right? Let's eat some pizza. We're um, actually just right around the corner. I'm waiting for the light to change so we can U-turn. And here we go, if he goes. Thank you. Is it going for him? He is? <laughs> oh, <I'm not. laughs> Press the gas. Yeah, keep your foot on it. <laughs> And music, I want music. like one of the hottest times of the day and <laughs> I don't got the legs for shorts so I'm out here in some yoga pants and <laughs> I don't know I'm just sweating my mask off that's all I'm doing out here that person's car is a pretty blue color you guys see that so we just finished having lunch and we 
are going to go to Walmart. We're passing by my old job. Bye. Bye. He's back there already enjoying his candy. I mean, who am I to keep him from living his life, you know? It's a pretty relaxed day other than today is Friday and I'm supposed to put out a video today and I'm going to be editing this video in a couple of hours and just putting it on YouTube for you guys. Um, we haven't done a vlog or anything like that in a while. I realized that with our vlogs over time we would get really good views but I just don't feel like we were that interesting. That wasn't as big as I thought it was going to be. Yeah, I just didn't think we were all that interesting. So I felt like people didn't really feel the vlogs. And I noticed that my Olive Garden mukbang is doing really good. If you guys go check it out, it's like at 420 views or something like that. And um, yeah, so I'm just like, do, do I got to eat? Like, are y'all asking me to eat? <laughs> you guys want me to eat? I mean, I'm just doing me, y'all. I'm just doing me, okay? So... Last night, I did a mukbang with my brother Diego, and um, I don't know how quick I'll be able to get it up. I just, I don't know. But um, anyways, yesterday, that mukbang was my first meal and my only meal all day long. And let me tell you why. The night before, I was in so much pain I did not sleep because my wisdom teeth have been killing me you guys like to the point that it puts pain in my ear like my ear hurts and then like right down here on my um like under my jawbone feels really swollen well I'm just like listen I've got to get to the dentist I'm in a lot of pain um I already know Ooh, there it goes <laughs> riding on a prayer now you guys did you hear that anyway so I was in so much pain and I know why it's because um, my wisdom tooth it has a pretty bad cavity and I've known that my dentist wanted me to have it pulled and so I just went ahead and did that instead of having my wisdom teeth pulled and boy do I regret not getting it done sooner so yesterday I went to the dentist and he's like yeah I see why you're in a lot of pain I am going to prescribe you antibiotics because um, the oral surgeon suggested that I get on some before having my wisdom teeth removed just to be sure there's no risk of infection or anything and um, so I seen my dentist he prescribed me antibiotics and I am scheduled next Thursday to have my wisdom teeth pulled all four and um, I am so nervous I like to think that I have a high pain tolerance I can I can take pain but when it comes to pain in my mouth or like my ears or my throat I don't know about anyone else but that those are like my uh my uh my uh like I will bend over in pain because of a little earache you know what I'm saying like I cannot deal with pain in the ear the throat or in my mouth I just I can't do it it hurts it hurts it hurts so I'm scheduled next Thursday and the person that's going to be taking me because as you guys know my husband he works a lot my brother Zach is off and he's gonna be my driver because of course I'm gonna be sedated um, he's gonna be my driver. He's gonna help with this guy back there and I told him if I am acting any type of crazy if I'm acting any type of funny like Please pull the camera out and record me because I want to try to get some good um, Like footage for you guys. So you guys may or may not be getting a wisdom tooth removal video um or the aftermath I should say I'm just so nervous for the pain my mouth is about to be put through but it's long overdue I'm in a lot of pain because of my teeth not being pulled out it just it needs to be done I can't avoid it any longer because it needs to be done it's just way too hot to be playing around at Walmart right now I'm not sure if I cut out the part where I said that we were coming to Walmart we just have to pick up a few things um, that we need around the apartment and <sighs> not for the beach I wish we were going to the beach though yes. that would be nice wouldn't it hmm. yeah. 
Why can't we go to the beach? But anyways, we are at Walmart right now. We have to just pick up a few things that we need and I'm gonna take you guys in with me until I get caught recording. That's good, Dada, Mommy. Okay. <laughs> you pick this on me. This and this. Mommy. Yeah, I see you. <laughs> you need more yardstick, Mommy? Yeah. Okay. This. You got your pyramid. We are back from Walmart and if you hear that noise in the background, I have an industrial fan on. Just kidding. It's a regular fan, but I'm hot so me so sorry. I just wanted to show you guys really quick everything that I purchased from Walmart. Um, I'm like Beyonce vibes right now. Look at my hair. 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 Mm. I'm just kidding. Okay. All right. Needed these. I use these to remove my makeup. So I needed more of my daily hydration moisturizer I needed more of this you guys I was pretty much on my last pump today I got this because me and Gracie we have pretty thick long hair and we're constantly running out and um, I buy the big bottle I buy this bottle I um, I don't know just help um, you guys know that I use Dove on my face and evidently my face takes a lot of soap so I went through my six pack like a nothing. So I needed more. Did I break anything? My husband requests that I hang dry a lot of his clothes um, just so they don't shrink. Diva. I've been hang drying his clothes and due to that it's um, caused a lot of lint to stay on his clothing. So he asked me to buy him some lint rollers. So here you go, ya linty mud. My hair is super thirsty, so I know I have some of these somewhere in there, but I like to buy two like pretty much every time I go to Walmart, just so I never run out. And if my hair ever needs a deep conditioning treatment, it's gonna get it. You're gonna get it. And then <laughs> we're just super dry around here, right? We're just like ashy linty Mexicans. Um, but anyways, last time I went to Walmart, I bought the wrong, um, lotion. I had got the original one, which, baby, we need ultra healing, okay? Our elbows are asking for it. Our heels are asking for it. So I had to go and get this. I also bought some hangers from Walmart. I like these because this little blue, greenish part right here is, um, like rubbery. So it helps hold your clothes on and they really don't fall off at all. One of the things I was excited about was this Swiffer that I purchased. Now this isn't for my whole apartment. I am a traditional woman, okay? I like to pull out the mop and the bucket and the soap and get down to the nitty gritty on my floors. But this is for the bathroom. I'm not about cross contamination, baby. That's just nasty. I don't if you're somebody that uses the same mop in your living room or in your kitchen as you do in the bathroom yeah nasty and of course I had to purchase the refills for it 
Um, so I'm pretty excited to use it, you guys. Now, yeah. I am my mother's daughter. I'm excited to use cleaning products. So another thing I picked up at Walmart was this bronzer by L'Oreal. It's in the number four. Um, I'm not pronouncing that because I'm going to look like an idiot. So I purchased this because I want to use a real bronzer or a real um, contouring powder. The reason is because right now I use a powder that's inside my James Charles palette. But I need to start venturing out and looking for other powders or other bronzers that I can use to kind of contour my face just because eventually that's going to run out and let's be honest i'm not going to go and purchase another james charles palette it's really not that serious um it's just that's going to run out quicker than everything else that i'm using because i use it pretty much every day so i'm not going to go purchase a whole other palette just for that one color hopefully this one works for me i feel like a lot of my issue is sometimes i don't find something that's dark enough so hopefully this is dark enough. Hopefully I don't have any issues and like break out or anything like that. But if you guys have any suggestions, put them down in the comments. Another thing that I purchased was by e.l.f. Um, I've shown you guys that I use the antioxidant booster drops. And they did have that at Walmart, but I wanted to try something a little bit different. Something that may be better for my skin, keeping it clear and everything. So I purchased these booster clarifying drops by elf and it says that it's a lightweight booster supercharges your routine with clarifying ingredients such as um tea tree and witch hazel so i thought let me go ahead and try this and just see how it does on my skin and then i got another product but i'm not sure i'm going to show you guys because i kind of want to do a review on it or put it in one of my makeup videos um before somebody else goes and tries to do it because they watch my videos but um so yeah secret product but anyways you guys we're at the end of this video and I really have to start editing because it's supposed to go up today. Yes, if you are watching this, this is me today. If you are looking for the secret question, today the secret question is, who is your favorite music artist? Um, put that down in the comments below. If you have multiple, I mean, I know how that is. I like tons of music artists. So give me like your top three. Be sure to share this video. The giveaway continues. And send me a screenshot that you've shared. I'm going to go ahead and leave you guys here. If you would like to support us, please share any video that you've enjoyed off of our channel. We love you guys so, so much. And we appreciate you for watching. Until the next video.